No, we can't. Push this. There we go. Yeah, I knew it. Bum, bum. No balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. Oh. David Matson. Of course. Well, this is what you get for playing cop. A real bullet. Uh, so did I do everything wrong or is it just Jefferson, it's over. You are not Let going to stop now. me. Got it. Oh Christ. David Madsen, you are one stupid son of a bitch. So don't blame me. Yeah, that wasn't right. Good thing we can go back in time. I mean, as I said, I really li love the future, but right now it's... You are not going to stop me. Boom, there we go. Yes, that's what you deserve, bitch. Oh, Lord, Max. Are you okay? Are you alright? Can you move? Yes. Thank you, David. Thank you. Don't thank me. You brought me here. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. Yeah. He won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson, now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Unless <laughs> she's going to take a photo? No. Save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Warren! Yes! I, I can use that picture he took of us. Shit! No signal. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson, but you won't need this anymore. Max, I'm sorry you had to be here. I better go outside and call Warren. Oh, please answer. Let's talk David? to him first. Are you okay? Look at this place. It feels like hell. Jefferson was going to kill me. You got here just in time. I'm glad. I always suspected that son of a bitch. You suspected everybody? I never did. Let's let's go for the little bit offensive stuff here. You kind of suspected everybody. Yes, and this is what I get for wasting all those hours on the Prescotts. I set my sights too wide. Lack of focus. I know the feeling. I wasn't surprised when you accused Nathan of drugging Kate Marsh. I thought so too. And Max, I'll never forgive myself for what happened to Kate. I feel like I helped push her off that roof. Not your fault, and Kate was bullied. Which is literally kind of the same, so not it's not your fault means this one here too. Uh, uh, let's make him comfortable. Don't blame yourself. Nathan and Jefferson are the ones who put her up there. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan killed Rachel and Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No. I should have told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and, and almost used it. I put the school in danger. We all make decisions we regret. But I have to admit, I'm impressed by you. And Chloe. And your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while well, you had each other. She learned from you. We're a great team. No, she does, did not learn from you. We're a great yeah. team. We are a great team. That's one of my problems. I'm not good at teamwork. Never was. Even in the service. I can't even imagine what you went through. I'm not gonna make any 
excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father, too, but when Joyce kicked me out, I had nothing. I was pissed off, I'm sorry. Are we sorry? No, am I really sorry? No. I was pissed off and wanted to rage. Yeah. I know the feeling. Too much. I'm going to tell Joyce I was wrong about you. She does love you. It's pretty obvious. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but... It's hard to come home after war. Most people don't know or care what it's like. Except Joyce. She gave me hope. A new life. And you saved mine. Chloe, is she? She would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. I promised Joyce I would go see a family counselor. Uh, I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. I don't expect her to call me dad, but maybe she'll stop calling me step douche. <laughs> so, where is Chloe? Uh, that's a uh, kind of a problem. Oh, okay, this is one of the big decisions. Oh my god, are we going to tell the truth or hide the truth? I mean, if we can go back in time, it doesn't matter anyway, but... I can't... Why is this a big decision? Why is this a big decision? Is he going to like kill Jefferson if I tell him the truth? But if I go back in time, whatever I tell him, it doesn't matter anymore, right? Uh, decisions, decisions, decisions. I am going to tell the truth. Or? Oh, I can rewind the time anyway, right? Yeah, let's let's see what if it's cool. I'm going with it. David, uh, Chloe is is dead. This isn't happening. It can't. No, God, not Chloe. Max, are you are you sure? Are you? Yes, I. I saw her. I, I saw a Jefferson killer in the junkyard last night. Last night? When I was feeling sorry for myself in my hotel room? I promised Joyce that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I never even told Chloe that I... God damn it! That I, I, yeah. What, what did you not tell her? You killed my wife's child, you sick fucker, and you took away my stepdaughter. David, wait! Yep, that was uh, promised. Already spoiled by me. I'm sorry <laughs> that I'm right. I'm a good detective. <clears throat> Max, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to see that. What a mess. What have I done? All that time I wasted with surveillance. Uh, Chloe, I'm sorry. Joyce, I failed you. My family. You didn't fail. You did your best. Max, you better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. David, thank you for saving me.
As you probably hear, I'm kinda speechless right now. Right under my nose. Um, should I? Jesus. Oh, there's. Oh, there are photos. All lives destroyed. Oh, I wanna burn all these photos. I hate looking at me like that. Okay. Look at the burning Damn. piece of shit. Jefferson torched everything. Now the only photo I can get is the one Warren took. Just looking at that makes me want to vomit. So yeah, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and investigate what the room here. Joyce? What? Frank isn't a bad person, but... He can't be in denial about the drugs he provided. There's a necklace. Oh, Chloe. I'm gonna save uh, you. For the last time. I just wake up. Let this be a nightmare. There's See? no way I'm leaving your necklace here. You won't be going, Jefferson, to any more shows. I wish I could keep killing you forever. No one would have looked for Nathan's body with this. Passenger Nathan Prescott, Los Angeles, one-way ticket. The Big Bus Company. So he wanted me even to like, yeah, just disappear. So like he ran away from home. What's this? Looks like Jefferson was planning a major security renovation with Prescott cash. Surveillance system. Drone cameras. HDTV monitors. Multi-control deck. Okay. What's Nobody this? will look at Jefferson's work the same. Mm. You killed my Chloe. Fucking sick humans, it's really. I mean, I I know this is a made up story and stuff, but these kind of stories happen here and there. Jefferson and what had the plenty fuck? of women who would have totally posed for him. I lost it, yeah. But he didn't want to give his subjects a choice. Sick bastard. Uh, left mouse button, leave the dog room. Let's see if Warren is responding. Holy shit. This storm is real. I need to find Warren. Yes! Warren, can you hear me? Never mind. Listen, do you have that photo you took last night in the parking lot? Yeah, but why? It wasn't that great a shot. Yes, it is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Whales Diner. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thanks to this Armageddon weather. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. I'm on my way. <laughs> Come on, that's crazy. Walk on the sidewalk outside. Seriously, Max, stay wherever you are. I don't think the storm is getting smaller. I'm kind of scared. That's okay. Me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. Bling bling. I have a bad, bad feeling about this. I trust Limbo, have been warning you people for years that our culture of sin and entitlement would lead to God striking us down. 
And I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station. Somebody get me the hell out of here now! Now, goddammit, how do I pay all those taxes <laughs> Not to get rescued. You have one new message. Message received yesterday at 9 p.m. Max, it's, it's Nathan. I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or, or I didn't want to hurt anybody. Everybody used me. <laughs> Mr. Jefferson is coming for me now. All this shit be over soon. Watch out, Max. He wants to hurt you next. I'm sorry. Holy shit. I really hope that there is an explanation why this tornado is coming. Has it something to do that she's rewinding the time so often? Or in this case, we. So, me. <laughs> Did rewind the time so often, or... Okay, I think I can move. Ward is at the Two Hills Diner. So hurry up. Uh, let me guess I need to rewind time to like avoid stuff. Something flying towards me. Shit. Alyssa needs help again. Of course she does. Sorry, Alyssa, but... Yeah, 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 I know, but I can't get up anything here. Can I go up here? Yes. Help me get down, Max! There's no way I'm letting Chloe die. Alyssa! Are you okay? Let me help you down. Yes, yes, please, Max. I don't want to die like this. Find something to get me down. Please, help me get down. That was easy. No, oh, it can't be that easy. Come on. Come on, Alyssa. Take my hand. Why can't you go alone? What the fuck? Here I go. Now you're two people under. Okay. You did it, Matt. Are you okay? Now and now she's like getting hit. I don't think we even I helped you like five times. This will be my masterpiece, what? What's this drawing? Why is there a drawing here? I can't think about all those children out there. Oh, what's hap what happened here? Oh, he's dead. Oh, I can't stand seeing these bodies. Well, then let's...